Yes, man, it really is me. Me is Zool, aka the instant burner, man. And I'm about to show y'all an easy and cheesy way to get the teardropper badge in half of a game. Yes, you heard me right. The teardropper badge in half of a game if you follow my method completely, man. Because if you are playing Pro Am, this badge is a necessity. So y'all make sure to stay tuned. From the hood, nigga, I will bag you. Back three, back three, back four. Before we get started, man, I need y'all to help your boy out, man, by hitting that like. It really helps out my channel. But the very first thing that you want to do, man, you want to go to your settings. Once you go to your settings, you want to put the difficulty on rookie. And also for this badge, if you want to get this badge in half a game, you want to put the game speed on 100. If you don't know how to change the game speed, because it is hidden on 2K16, you want to click on the link in the top right of your screen, man. But once you're in the game, on offense, what you want to do, man, you want to do the old school pick and roll. Just run a pick and roll. If you come off that pick and roll and you're not open, what you want to do is just keep calling the pick and roll. Keep calling the pick and roll until you come off that pick and you're open like you see on the screen right now. And to do a floater, man, you have to be foul line extended or closer and you have to flick the right stick back with no turbo to do the floater. On defense, you want to call a full court press. The reason you want to call a full court press, you will get a lot. I'm talking about a lot of turnovers. If you want to know how to get more turnovers with pit pocket, don't forget to hit the top right of your screen right now, man. You could damn near get 20 steals a game with my method. But, like I said, you want to go for the full court press. If you don't get a quick Steal. If you do not get a quick steal, let your defender shoot. Yes, I said let your defender shoot. The game is on rookie as you see on the screen right now. They will miss a lot of these shots and once they miss the shots, you are running at the other end with the fast break, man. You're running with a fast break. And it's an easy bucket, man. It's a very easy bucket. But after a while, your defenders are going to start to double teaming you. They're going to start to double team you. Once they start to double team you, you want to try to move with the ball before the double team gets to you. Move, 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 and try to outrun the double team like you see right here, man. Try to outrun the double team before it gets to you. But, and also another method, man, you got to start cherry picking even more. You got to really cherry pick once you start getting double teamed too, you know what I'm saying? Like you seeing right here, man, you just, you got to double, you got to pretty much cherry pick. Just like I said earlier, you know what I'm saying? You have to once the double team gets there so you can get even more fast breaks and get this badge in less than one game. But that's pretty much it, man. It's a very, very simple, very, very needed badge for guards, man. Especially if you are running the Pro-Am, man. You need this badge. It is a necessity and a must. If this helped y'all out, please don't forget to hit that like button. If you're new, man, please hit that sub. Up, man you don't want to miss i got a lot of great tutorials cheesy tutorials coming in the future if you have not followed me on instagram don't forget to follow me man at i jammed on you as you see on the screen man i, I give y'all little updates and i also give y'all upcoming videos that you do not want to miss out on y'all already know who this is it is your boy Mizzle.